Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Football Manager 2018, playing as Medellin. And uh, we're coming off a pretty disappointing loss in our last game. We um, played a really good game overall, and just lost it in the last, like, five minutes of the game. I mean, we were we brought it back to a tie game, which, you know, if you're in a away game, you know, and you, you get a draw, that's actually usually pretty good. Um... And then at the 88th minute, they, they scored, a, scored a goal. I don't know if the guys were just demoralized or what, but they, they, they let another one go at the, you know, 92. So, uh, disappointing. I mean, we did score, you know, which, you know, it's, I'm glad to see the guys scoring. And we played, like I said, played a really good game. In fact, in some ways, we were probably the better the better side that day. But just giving up two goals at the very end there, just very, very unfortunate for the guys. So, Hopefully we can turn it back around against our next team and uh, we'll see what we can do. Um, why are these guys highlighted actually? I'm not sure what that purpose or reasoning is, to be honest. Um, I don't know. They're, they're just a different color. Does it say here anything? Yeah, I have no idea why they're, they're a different color. Anyway. We're going to get going. So we got how many days till the next game? We got about five days. So let's go ahead and just get through some of this stuff. Still very unfortunate loss. I don't know what we can do about that. I mean, the guys are probably going to be very disappointed. Um, if I go look at the team dynamics, uh, average, I mean, getting there. It's the match cohesion. We're just not getting the match cohesion no matter what we do. So I don't know what's going to come of that. We'll see what we can do. Uh, the one thing I would say is we did try a different tactic against that, uh, that junior team. Um, Go ahead and say yes to all these. That's fine. Uh, ball control. You know what? Why not? You guys are our reserve. Oh, actually, our, that's our main team. Uh, sure. Why not? We'll do with ball control if they think that's advisable. We'll do that for now. We're not really getting much from the team cohesion anyway. I don't want to just keep wasting time doing that for no reason. Um, we did try a different tactic. Like I said, we tried, we tried this four-three-one-two narrow because it was actually a tactic that uh, Junior was susceptible to, and we had a lot of good chances. So it seemed like it did work out fairly well for us. It's just, you know, maybe we should have gone a little more defensive in the last part of the game. But obviously, I'm still trying to get another score myself. So going too defensive meant, you know, I wouldn't be able to be, you know, aggressive. But I should have just been happy with the the, the tie, I suppose, and uh, and pulled the guys back or something. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. It'll be all right. Um, Phil's focusing on attacking movement will be a good match preparation for the upcoming match. We'll do attacking movement. Sounds fine with me. I don't know how how good my coaches are in that regard, but we'll, we'll, we'll try it out. See if, see if we can get something from them that, that helps us out a little bit. We'll get our mus mascara guy back, uh, which is good. We had to pull in a backup goalie, although we didn't actually use him. So didn't really make that much difference in the game, but, uh, mascara actually wants some more first time play time or fir first team play time. So we may let him play the next game or something. We'll see once more first team chances. Okay. Um, Okay. We'll try it then, I guess. We'll see if we can get you in there. Uh, what are you? You are a just a central defender. Well, just so I don't forget, we'll move you up there. I mean, you're not as good as our other guys, though. But, you know, giving the other guys a little bit of a rest, there's nothing wrong with that, I suppose. Um, let's see. Anybody here that needs to be dealt with? Has not been good enough. Oh, absolutely. You know what? We'll criticize you. Uh, your performances have been declining recently. Try to pick yourself up in the next few matches. You're right. Uh, of course I'm right. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, the most vulnerable to 3142. Defensive midfield. They're successful against 442, so we probably don't want to. Oh, no, no, that's that's their most successful. Sorry. I think I misread that. 3142. I have no idea if that's even something we could field. Uh, under 19's fitness coach. I mean, we do have, you know, a decent amount of money. Actually, fitness on that guy was incredibly good. Fitness on that guy is really good, too. We'll see. How much would you take? Um, give me a little bit less. Cool. All right. Sure. Be a fitness coach for our under 19 guys. That's fine. Hopefully, get some good. Good guys coming up out of the under-19s to fill out our team going forward. 
Oh boy. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do. Don't know what we're going to do. We may try a different tactic, just mess around, see what it does. Like I said, that, that, um, what was it I was playing though? The, the four, come back here. The four, three, one, two, narrow, whatever it was. Actually played pretty well. I felt like the guys did all right. Uh, they had a little bit of a slow start in the first half, but they picked it up in the second half, which is the towards the end. So they said three, five. Is that what it said? Three. Was it three, one, four, two? What did they say? I mean, I'm just going to look at it. I don't know if I'll actually play it or not. Um, 3142DN. 3142DN. Set to formation. 3142DN. Pretty defensive, uh, I would say. I mean, getting all of these guys back here and just obviously you got the def defensive uh, midfielder here. Um, leaves these guys open on the sides. We have to really be counting on our wings to be able to kind of just control a lot of this um i don't know i'm not sure if i'm liking the defensive vulnerability potential here but i mean overall familiarity is you know not amazing and obviously we need to move some guys around to, to help the uh position real duty stuff the width is not super great i'll come back to that we'll, we'll look at that here in a moment we'll, we'll, we'll let's sit there for a second see what it see what it does i don't know what I mean, how would you play that? I guess you'd play that more counter because you're going to have a lot of space up there where the strikers are. You say 4 3 one, two, narrow. Attacking, really. Really. That's if we do the 4 3 one, two, narrow, I think. More supporting of, and, and attacking. You know, we are home games, so being a little more attacking could be good. Be more expressive, sure. No, let's try it. Let's just, I, I don't know. I mean, obviously, we're not doing that part, though. 4, 3, 1, 2, narrow. How, I mean, how good are you at tactics? Honestly, you're not that good at tactics. Do we have a different guy that we can pull in there for tactics? Let's see here. Um, staff, responsibilities, first team. Is it first team something? Um, coach, report advice. Is that what that is? Carlos Rojas. I think it's this guy. So we want somebody who gives us the best tactics. So who's who do we have that is the best on tactics? Or is it somebody or is he one of the guys here maybe? No, I think it's that one. Um staff overview. Let's go to coaching team. Best tactics. Probably us, to be honest. Why am I not seeing tactics? Which tactical knowledge is that it? Rojas. No, he's more than an eight. This is not the right. Mental attributes. Coaching attributes. There we go. I mean, I'm assuming it's this one. It could be something else. Tactical coaching. I mean, obviously, we are the highest by far. Ivan Corridor. I mean, Rojas is a 10. I mean, it's not much farther off. So I don't know. I don't know how much we can count on his abilities because I just don't know if he's that good or not. And his tactical knowledge is only an eight, though. Does anybody else have better tactical knowledge? Let's see. Go back to staff. And that was under the mental. Tactical knowledge. Best one is Silva over here. Silva or Corridor. Either one of those. Actually, I don't know which, which attribute it goes off of. I'm assuming it goes off of the tactical knowledge, to be honest. But just in case, we may try Corridor here. Responsibilities. First team, change you to a corridor. Maybe you're a little bit better. But in the meantime, you know, we'll go with it. We'll swap to it. I mean, it's the one we have the best um, knowledge about, so we'll try that out. They're in 16th place, and we're a home game, so I'm really hoping the guys um, just really come through for this one. Just re really need to get some motivation in us. Uh, under 15, or under 19, sorry, uh, fitness coach. Sure. We're not paying them that much. 
Sure, if you get any recommended signings, why not? Match preview. Inconsistent for both of us. Well, that's something. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's something. All right, Mosquera, you come back up here. Uh, then just swap with this guy. Uh, we can send Gomez actually back to... Back to reserve squad? Yes. All right, so that's good. And then Echeverria, Echeverria, whatever. You're actually a center guy. So let's move you to there. Try you out. Why not? We'll see what you do. And then here. Not to see you. It's fine. Strepo probably swapping for Gomez. Actually, Tipton, right? Because we gave him a promise. Just, just to give him a chance. Uh, everybody else looks okay. Seguria, so the only reason he's in here is because his coach was not happy with us not playing him. Oh, we'll give him another chance. He's not playing very well, but we'll give him one more chance. He's actually not that good, to be honest. I don't think we can afford it. You know what? We got to go with guys we know we can play well. Sorry, coach of yours. I mean, we can pull you in and maybe use you as a sub. I don't think so. Honestly, if your coach gets mad and pulls you back, then so be it. You're just not good enough for us. Um, oh, this is a 4-3-1-2 Nero. Okay, this is actually what we played against the other team. So, yeah. Uh, let's go with... Catano... Tanya would actually be better up here, right? Yeah. That's fine. Let's pull Haneo in, and we'll pull in... I guess we'll do Ricarda. I mean, do I want to swap these guys around, though? I mean, what's your best, Ricarda? All right, I do want to change this a little bit. Let's get us... You know, let's try you as a deep-line playmaker supporting. Let's try you as a... Come on. We're just supporting box to box. You can play central midfield or defensive. That's fine. We'll even keep you on defense for now. Uh, you guys, I actually want you guys to be a bit more kind of attacking side of things. Two central defenders are fine. Um, uh, supporting. Let's make you. You're supporting. You're attacking. Probably all okay make these guys a bit more aggressive, but that's okay. All right, cool. I think I'm okay with that. Uh, anybody else that I had a promise for? No, we're good. Anybody else want to swap around? I mean, Kano just not doing well, but we did we did talk to him, so maybe maybe we'll light a fire up under him. Uh, Moreno here, actually. Actually, a couple of our guys are pretty tired. We attempted does have a promise, but he's pretty tired as well. Do we have anybody from Moreno? Let's bring in Restrepo. Nope, he's not any any better. No, we'll go with it. We got some guys we can swap in or something. I'm going to bring Viafara up as a sub. We'll bring Cordoba as actually a sub. It's good. Gomez is already a sub. That's fine. Guys in the middle. Make sure Hernandez is in there, so that's good. We'll just bring him up a little bit, though. Just keep him in the, in the mix. Restrepo's also good. Balanta is in there. That's fine. And Restrepo, okay, that's okay. And then Strikers. Castro, really? Is our best? I guess this is a deep line forward. Um, don't have him in the mix right now. Pull him in instead of Restrepo or one of these other guys. Actually, Restrepo's pretty tired. You know, let's try it. Where are you? You are Castro's right there. I mean, you don't have a lot of uh, sharpness, but, you know, maybe we could sub you in. Get you a little bit of sharpness built up. Let's try it, guys. We'll try it. Oh, I didn't send any team notes, but that's okay. Much better performance, guys. Come on. 
Both teams come into this one in a spell of poor form. Is there, there, is this therefore a good opportunity to step up and arrest your recent struggles? It's a great opportunity for that. Slow down this just a smidge for, for your guys' viewing pleasure. All right, come on, guys. Come on. We got a home game. This is our chance to prove ourselves. I mean, we're not super familiar with the tactics, but we're okay. I think we're going to be pretty well. Kaichetto, come on. Get that. Cross in it. Cross in. Right there. Kano. Oh, that would have been a good way to start the game. 18 seconds in. So close. Plus giving Kano a, uh, a goal, finally. Ugh. I really just need to drop him off my list. I just don't think he's ever going to be what we need. Short passing game. Uh, sure. You know what? Since I forgot to send any notes or any team instructions, we'll go ahead and do that. That's fine. We're a little bit better rested than uh, the, the other guys, so that is good to see. We're playing a very aggressive game. A very aggressive game. Apparently, we're being overrun in the middle. I don't know what we can do about that. I mean, we can change some stuff, but I think we're going to be okay. Oh, they got an injury. Tipped and thrown in. Caicedo over to Moreno. Ricarta. Good. Oh, I thought that was going in. Oh, I thought that was going in. I guess he didn't even get a hand on it, so it was really very much over the over the top. Oh, what was that, dude? What kind of pass was that? That was nothing. Valencia. Tassio, Ricarta, Haneo, back over to Moreno, up to Cano, uh, hitting the guy in the back of the head. I don't know what that was. Ricarta over to Tassio. Come on, let's get a good cross. Right there, C Cachero. Oh, you had it. You had it. I thought you had it. Oof, so close. All right, let's keep an eye on this. I mean, are they? their guys are playing pretty well overall. So I don't know if I need to change any, like, attacking one side or another better. Uh, and we can jump on this guy who's got an injury a little bit more, I suppose, but. Uh-oh. Didn't get that header. There's Echeverria. Who's wanting some more playtime. Let's we'll see if he can do anything with it. Gomez. Up to the injured guy, Vasquez, Hernandez. They got their own Hernandez as well. Come on, guys. Show me what you got. Get on, get on him. It's a very long highlight so far. Uh oh, Hernandez. Come on, get on him. No, don't let him have that one. Come on, guys. What was that? Ah, uh, we are just, just not getting it together. Maybe it's too many tactics changes or something. I don't know. It's supposed to be very aggressive in this game, but I mean, we, we got just as many shots as they do. We got more on target. That's just the one that they have on target is the one that went in. So, oh, that was a great steal, but no, he could not get past the goalie. Oh, that was... That was pretty impressive for a second there, but just didn't couldn't finish it. I didn't see who that was. Actually, honestly, I, I forgot. I didn't see the player who that did that. Ah, oh, Partuz, you let that get taken from you. Come on, man. Come on, guys. Stop him. Stop him. Right there. Right there. Right there. There we go. Get that back. Man. Oh, a couple good opportunities here. Got five shots, three of them on target. I mean, we're just... Being very aggressive, just can't get anything to go in. Uh oh, Ricardo pulled half string, huh? We'll see how he is after halftime. I mean, it's already halftime, so we'll see how he looks after halftime. Try more long balls forward, huh? It's not letting us make the changes right now. All right, whatever. Go to the dressing room. Seems very frustrated. Don't be frustrated, buddy. Apparently, they just listened keenly, huh? Attack. Seems motivated. Our midfield's actually doing pretty good. They're fired up. Cool. 
Um, actually, let's pause for a second. Is Ricardo? Yeah, he's still injured. We got to pull him out of there. All right, Hernandez, you've done some good stuff for us in the past. Let's see if you can get in there and show us what you got, man. Show us what you got. All right. Oh, come on. Don't let him get up there, man. There we go. Get that back. There we go. It's an early sub for us, but it's all right. Come on. Cross it in there. Okay, no. Come on. Show us what you got. You've been telling me all this time. That's good. That was a good, good pass. I mean, come on, man. We need more of that, buddy. Need more of that. I mean, that guy was over to Caicedo, right? Cano to Caicedo. Yep, right there. Just right there in front, set up, ready, easy go. Well done, guys. Well done. More crosses in. No, I agree, actually. More crosses would be good. Float crosses, pump ball into ball character. You know what? I'm actually okay with those. I don't think I'm okay with those for now. We'll leave those alone. But uh, I'm okay with the crosses because we are generally, I mean, we checked it at the beginning of the year, but we're generally one of the taller teams. So getting more crosses in there hopefully is better for us. Carter looks angry. Well, dude, you were injured, man. I didn't pull that up for any other reason than that, man. And it was first yellow card. Uh, yeah, it's ease off tackles, buddy. Ease off the tackles. Don't want you to get a red card by any stretch of the imagination. All right, come on. This is the same thing we did last time. Let's get up there. Oh, except you took it away. Nope, wait, wait. We got it back. We got it back. Get it in there. Nope. Let them have it. Oh, it's going back and forth here. Come on, guys. Kind of being a little chaotic here. Come on, guys. It's a little more control here. Catano. Cachetto. Oh, I thought that was going in. So close. That would have been awesome to get a second goal for him. Come on, Hernandez. Over to Moreno. Come on. What you doing with it? Hernandez. I've seen you do some good stuff, Hernandez. Oh, I mean, just got to take some of those shots every once in a while. It's okay. Well, let's get this set up for another another go at this, man. Uh, I guess that's the end of the highlight. Oh, don't just stand there and let him take that from me, buddy. All right. Who are we going to change out now? Um... Nobody's especially tired. Anybody playing especially poor? Looks like Haneo actually is not playing well. And he's also got a yellow card. We don't really have anybody to sub in for him, though. Um, we could pull Catano back, maybe. Do we have anybody for Catano? Yeah, Belanta could actually play there. So, it's not great, but let's pull you back and pull Belanta into here. Um, and having a little bit more, you know, energy up front is probably okay. If we did swap you two guys, would you be better? I don't think you'd be any better. Let's just leave it the way it is. Okay, this is going to be fine. We're still playing fluid and attacking. I mean, we want to we wanna be aggressive. We're at a home game. Fans are on our side. Keep the aggression up. That's fine. If we go up a score, we'll drop that back a little bit. But for now, I'm okay with it. I mean, we got eight shots, five on target. Two clear-cut chances. We should be like... Three nothing right now. Well, three to one or something. We've got the possession. I mean, we're playing such an overall good game other than things like that. What is that, guys? And why is our goalkeep just being dumb? Uh, I don't want to say that again. Mascara, we're giving you a chance and you're just not playing well. Sorry, buddy. I mean, we gave you a chance. Come on, come on right. Oh, what was that? Off the back of your foot. Caicedo, what was that? I mean, <laughs> I don't know what you're doing, kicking it that far up, but whatever. Hmm. 
Come on, guys. We need to see something from you. Blanta. Over to Tessio. Ah, uh, come on. Good little move to get past that first, you know, whatever. But you didn't do a good pass afterwards. Kano. Oh, that would have been a, that would have been some redemption there for Kano if he could get a goal there as well as an assist in this game. All right, I'm gonna do our last sub real quick. Uh, Catania is just not playing well. Echeverria is not playing well. Let's bring in Cordoba. Make sure we're at least not giving up another goal. Maybe we'll have a chance to bring this back to a draw. But, man, we got to get better in the draw at home. we got to get these wins at home. Our fans are expecting more from us. Come on, Tipton. What you got? Nah. Get past that tackle attempt. Catan or Kano. Oh, I thought you were going to get that in. Come on, buddy. Let me get that down a little bit better next time. I mean, he's playing okay today, honestly. He's at 6.9. He's actually our best player today. Up there with Caicedo. Come on, guys. Just need, just need something else. It's a little bit more. You know what? Um, show some passion, guys. Cano. Come on, what you got? Hernandez. Up to Cano. Get another assist here. Get another assist right here. Ah, uh, just not. Just wasn't close enough or just not enough power or something. I don't know. Ah. Might have like one more chance here. Cano, wow. Getting way up there. Uh, Just going to let that roll out, guys? What, what, what's this? Like nobody even tried to go after that? That was, that was a little weird. I actually thought Kano was in a good spot. If we just had somebody over there, maybe he just he won a good pass, obviously. 13 shots, 6 on target. Only 4 fouls. <laughs> we played a good game. Just not, not getting them to go in. And that is about to be game. Nope, that's it. Wow, guys. That's two back-to-back -back really good games, just statistically, but just can't get the goals to go in. I don't know. I mean, I don't know that we just, I don't know if we panic. I think we just hold on and just be, be accepting of the fact that just, just things aren't going away, and we'll, we'll get through there. We'll play the match later than you. You will surely be watching and hoping someone can do you a favor. Um... I'm confident in my team is uh, in my team to push on and put this disappointment behind us. But uh, what everybody else gets up to is their business. Eh, sure, why not? Rodriguez goal today consigned your team to defeat. How will that result affect your team? I can see the team already itching to bounce back. The goal Rodriguez scored against your team today was particularly impressive. What do you make of it? It was fantastic. Why not? We'll be we'll be positive. All right. Well, man, it's a couple of good games. Just we can't finish them. We just cannot finish them. I mean, we scored in all three of the last three games, which is good to see. We're just um, we're giving up some goals ourselves. Um, maybe I'm being too too accepting of my guys complaining and letting some of my, my not-as-good players in there. But honestly, some of these, this stretch right here, we're playing some of our better players. So I don't know that that's ex actually what it is. So we'll see. Next game is an away game. Um, so the next game you guys will see. Actually, there's two away games back-to-back. -back. So the next game you guys will see will be the Copa. Libertadores, that's probably not how that's said, um, over here. So hopefully we have some better news when we get back. We'll see. But I do appreciate you guys watching. Thank you and goodbye.